My name is Judy Ames and I'm a teacher at Carnahan and I'm going to share with you one of my very favorite books called Piggy Pie. Don't be scared, these aren't real. This is a book by Margie Palatini. You're going to love it. Grinch the Witch woke up grouchy, grumpy, and very hungry. Her belly grumbled for something delicious, something delightful, something special. But what? It wasn't Purple Mouse Tail Stew. No, she had that yesterday for lunch. Maybe some mashed dragon tongue pudding. No, Grinch wasn't in the mood for anything quite that sweet. Perhaps a taste of boiled black buzzard feet. No, that always made her mouth water, but not today. Today, Grinch would, wanted something truly tasty, something really yummy, something special. And that could only mean <gasps> piggy pie. Yes, yes, piggy pie. I can taste piggy pie, those plump, juicy pink piggies right now, Grinch said, smacking her lips. She hurried to her pantry and pulled down her old hag cookbook from the top shelf. She picked off a spider, blew off the dust, and turned to the secret recipe on page 342. Grinch ran her bony finger with the long green nail down the list of ingredients. One eye of a bright. She checked the pantry shelf. Check, no problem, said Grinch. Two shakes of a rattle snail, snake's rattle. <gasps> no problem, said Grinch. A belly hair of a possum. No problem, said Grinch. Eight plump piggies. <gasps> problem, screeched Grinch. with a jump. The circus! Yes, yes, the circus! The circus? No, no, not the circus. You don't find pigs in the circus. She thought harder. Ah! Oh, she shouted. The zoo! Yes, yes, the zoo! The zoo? No, no, not the zoo. You don't find pigs in the zoo. She thought much harder. The farm. Yes, yes, the farm. You find piggies on a farm. There still was just one teeny little problem. Where to find a farm? Where else? Grinch let her bony fingers do the walking and open the yellow pages to F, where she found a very large ad. This is what it said. Old McDonald's farm called E.I. E-I-O, just over the river and through the woods, we have ducks, chickens, and piggies. Grinch pulled her broom, put her broomstick in gear, and headed over the river and through the woods to Old MacDonald's farm. I've got you in my sights now, you little porkers, she crackled as she circled overhead. Look what she wrote. Surrender, piggies. I think an airplane does that too. Hmm. <gasps> Grinch zoomed in for a thump, bump, 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 screech. 
landing. She spit straw, fanned her still smoking tootsies, and lifted her goggles. There wasn't a pig in sight. Where did they go all go? Breach shouted to a duck. Hey duck, I said, where are all the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The duck quack quack here, it quack quack there, here it quack, there it quack, everywhere it quack quack, no piggies. What do you mean no piggies, you dizzy duck? Grinch screeched into his bill. I just saw a parcel of piggies down here not a minute ago. Hand over those hogs, you little quacker. No piggies. Quack the duck. Grinch pulled her hair. She stomped her feet. She even threatened the duck with one of her most evil spells. The duck was not impressed. It wasn't even scared. It gave Grinch another quack and waddled away. So who needs a dumb duck? Grinch grumbled. Being careful where she stepped, Grinch wandered across the meadow. Yoo-hoo, she shouted. Mur. You, Grinch said to the cow, where are the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The cow, mmm, here, mmm, there, here it, mmm, there it, mmm, everywhere it, mmm, mmm, no piggies. What do you mean no piggies, you lumpy looking cow? screamed Grinch. I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. Fork over the pork, you walking milk machine, or I'll curdle your cream. No piggies, mooed the cow. Grinch pulled her hair. She stomped her feet. She even threatened the cow with one of her most evil spells. The cow stared at Grinch, swatted a fly with his tail, and lumbered away. Cows, who needs them? mumbled Grinch. So she tried the barnyard where she stopped a chicken in its tracks. Okay, bird brain, where are the piggies? I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. The chicken cluck clucked here, it cluck clucked there, here it clucked, there it clucked, everywhere it cluck clucked. No piggies. What do you mean no piggies, you feather, feathered drumstick? Grinch screeched. It's what's going on here. Who's the boss of this heap of hay? The chicken flapped her wing toward old MacDonald. Grinch looked him over once, twice. You're old MacDonald, she said. You don't look much like your picture, do you? The farmer thumbed his suspenders and shrugged. Hmm. Look, Shorty, I've been quack quacked here moo mooed there and cluck clucked everywhere all over this farm. I need eight plump piggies for piggy pie. Where are the piggies? The farmer looked here. He looked there. Here he looked. There he looked. Everywhere he looked. No piggies. What do you mean no piggies, you flea-bitten seed spreader? You must have piggies. Grinch pulled her hair, stomped her feet and even threatened him with one of her most evil spells. No piggies! Her stomach growled. It grumbled, but there were no piggies. There would be no piggy pie. Now what was she going to eat? Psst, psst, psst. Excuse me, little lady. Wolf's the name. Let me give you some advice. Forget about the pigs. Forget about the pigs, said Grinch, eyeing the wolf. He nodded. They're too tricky, trust me. I've been chasing three little pigs for days. I've huffed and puffed. I'm starving. Look at me, nothing but skin and bones. Grinch pitched his arm. Well, not quite, she grinned. Mr. Wolf, I have the most wonderful idea. I was thinking, since you haven't eaten, and I haven't eaten, why don't you come home with me for lunch? 
I'm a very good cook. Why, that does sound tempting, the wolf said as he looked at Grinch and smacked his lips. Are you sure it wouldn't be any problem? Problem, Grinch grinned. No problem at all, she said as they walked off arm in arm. I enjoy having a wolf for lunch. I hope you like that book. I love this one. Go check it out and look at all the pictures for yourself.